We say no to violence against women and girls living in and around oil palm plantations around the world and particularly in Africa. In West and Central African countries, tens of thousands of hectares of forest have been invaded by industrial oil palm plantations. When companies set up these industrial plantations, violence against women increases. Violence takes place in different forms. Forests are destroyed, and with them, many species that are useful for women's economic activities. Sacred sites, places of worship and rites, tombs, women's cultural mix are swallowed up. All this contributes to destabilize women. In this region, food production rests mainly on women's shoulders. Women no longer have access to land close to their houses to cultivate and provide food for their families and community. Women are forced to give up their bodies to enter the plantations in search of means of survival for their family. When community lands are taken over by company plantations, the only place left for women to cultivate, grow some cassava and beans is along the pesticide infected fringes of the company plantations. Or the need to walk long distances on deserted roads through the plantations to reach their garden plots on lands in neighboring villages rather away from their own villages. This exposes women to sexual violence and abuse, particularly from security guards who patrol the company plantations. Rape and abuse are also a reality for women who work on the plantations. If you are lucky, you only get paid. If you let the guy do his thing, it happens all the time. I work two times in the week, and during those two days, the headman will always touch all the women's breasts and butts, all the time, including me. Once established, the companies do everything possible to maximize their profits at the expense of the women for whom the land was taken to set up the plantations. The well-being of local women is not their priority. Nous-mêmes, on souffre. Pour la palmeira, ils ont mis les, les rigoles que si quelqu'un veut aller prendre un, un peu de noix pour faire les légumes, Il ne peut même pas monter sur les collines là. Si quelqu'un joue, il peut mourir. Sur la palmeira là, il ne nous donne rien. Il ne fait même pas prendre nos enfants, ni nous-mêmes. Among the many plants that women in the region use, Oil palms have a special importance. From oil to medicines, women produce a large variety of products from the palm trees. Selling the surplus provides an income. Without land for collecting traditional oil palm nuts, women are forced to collect the loose nuts from the industrial plantations. In country after country, Women report continuous harassment, violence, and abuse over the use of traditional palm oil. Women living inside and around the plantations are always at risk of being accused of having stolen nuts from the company plantations, of being searched, beaten, arrested, and sexually abused by company guards and police who accuse them of thefts. 
Maintenant, pour ramasser les noix, on nous défend. Donc, pour, pour que tu dois manger les deux noix là, il faut que tu, tu dois avoir tous les maris de la ferme suisse. Tout, tous les gens de la ferme suisse, même les, même les gens qui sont à la gendarmerie, il faut leur donner l'argent, sinon on va t'enfermer. C'est eux-mêmes qui viennent même à côté de ton mari pour dire que avec les noix, j'accouche ta femme. Ah, oui. Donc c'est si c'est là, même dans, dans les bars, même dans le, 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 là où on voit les matangos. Quelqu'un marche avec ton nom et, ton, et le nom de ton mari. Donc en ce moment, le mariage est... To end violence, we must first help to break the silence and denounce the violence, and in particular, the sexual violence that results from large-scale industrial plantations. Women are not only victims of abuse. They are also at the forefront of resistance struggles against industrial plantations. Women are organizing themselves to so collectively clear back their lands and forests. Because land and forest means being able to produce food. It means having food sovereignty.